For over a century, big cat sightings have been reported around New South Wales and it's caused quite a debate on whether there's any merit to the claims panther-like creatures roam our countryside. Well, Network 10's Grant Denyer says he's found the home of the elusive black panther on his Bathurst farm. It's an urban myth that's now etched into Australian folklore. A panther-like creature stalking the landscape and there's real believers. I know what I saw. I've heard the urban myths for decades, but I saw it with my own two eyes. Over the years, there's been thousands of reported big cat sightings across the country. It's even got documentary makers interested in the mystery. The amount of people that have seen or know of somebody that's seen these is just amazing. Only recently, footage emerged of a prowling feline figure in Sydney's northern suburbs. Network 10 celebrity Grant Denyer believes he's also got one on his rural property near Bathurst and he's captured it on iPhone. I know what I saw, man. It was a black cat that did not look like a cat, didn't walk like a cat, walked like a panther, about five to ten times the size of a domestic cat, and um, it blew my mind. Plenty of theories have done the rounds on why there's been traces of giant paw prints across four states. So I want that concrete evidence. I want to blow this myth wide open. So this, is, uh, this is ground zero, my friend. Ground zero for panther viewing. Check this out. Have a look at this hole. Something's been living in here. It was hiding and emerging out of here at, at night. <laughs> Not funny, man. Not funny. If it moves from one sector of the camera to another part of the sector, it'll take five snaps instantaneously. You, you did a story for 10 years, uh, a few years back, didn't you? Yeah. Uh, regarding something like this. Well, that's the first I'd ever heard of the story. His late night walk to his letterbox was a near disaster. The monster Mog decided to go for his throat. Now that some evidence has been collected, this monster cat is anything but ordinary. So, mate, this... Wow, it's the killing field. Yeah, it's a scene of devastation for, um, for this, this sheep. It had sort of bite marks underneath its arm. Let's play Australia's favourite new game show. What lives in that hole? But it's another game show that Denya is now preparing for. Family Feud, which returns to 10 on August 18. It's almost like a show that you just can't kill. You can't predict or plan what someone's going to say next, and that's the magic of it. What's a baby lamb called? <laughs> and name the first thing people may do on retirement. Well, I've got nothing. Go to the strippers. <laughs> The 10 episode series will be dedicated to celebrating frontline emergency and healthcare workers. You know, what's a great way to honour those that have put other people's health before their own through this horrible 2020? You know, on behalf of Australia, you know, thank you. Michael Kane for 10 News First.